RFID system is introduced by Navi Mumbai Municipal Corporation and AG Enviro Solutions along with the German technology partner MOBA for better monitoring of day-to-day -day waste collection activities. MOBA provides a platform for monitoring daily bin-wise collection from the societies, commercial complexes, markets, where garbage bins can be tracked and monitored flawlessly. This way the operations are done more efficiently and effectively to ensure all the waste generated from the city is cleaned and provided better and healthy environment to the residents of Navi Mumbai. Navi Mumbai Municipal Corporation is divided into two zones, Parimandal 1 and Parimandal 2. Parimandal 1 area consists of four wards, CBD Belapur, Nerul, Vashi and Turbe. Parimandal 2 area consists of four wards, Kopar Kherane, Gansoli, Eroli and Digha. All the bins are assigned a unique RFID number embedded in the transponder chip also known as RFID tags which is riveted onto the bin. The lifting of the bin is detected by a position sensor mounted on the tailgate which then activates the RFID reader. The RFID antenna sends UHF waves towards the bins which reads the unique identification code from the transponder chip and reflects it back to the reader. Once the RFID antenna recognizes the unique code, it gives a visual indication to the operator confirming the reading process. The RFID reader then sends the unique code information to the CG1 device, which then couples this information with the location and timestamp and relays it to the cloud-based mobile internet platform. The data is then stored into the data server and the same is then used by the mobile web platform for analysis and report generation which can be viewed by the user and corporation from any internet enabled computer. Approximately 14,000 garbage bins are attended daily from Navi Mumbai area. The garbage collection bins are tagged with RFID passive tags which are read by the UHF readers mounted on the compactor vehicles when the garbage bins are emptied into the compactor. The bin trigger light starts blinking, confirming the completion of the pick activity. The RFID red signal is passed to the CG1 device, which integrates the bin reading with the location coordinates and pushes the data of the bin RFID number and location code to the server through GPRS. The data captured is viewed in multiple reporting form to monitor the day-to-day -day bin collection activity for which bin is attended on the route and which is missing. To keep the community bin location area clean, two water tankers are deployed which washes the bins and its surroundings on regular basis. The daily routine starts with laborers and drivers arriving at the parking space to take charge of the vehicles. Respective drivers collect the keys of the vehicles. After the in time is logged in the logbook and completing the security check, they head towards their respective routes to collect the garbage from the bins. Wet waste is collected in green bins. Dry waste is collected in blue bins and green waste is directly dumped in the dumper tippers. Similarly, each mini tipper which is also equipped with a high power transponder chip to relay the information on every dumping cycle by that particular tipper into the main garbage compactor. To improve the reach and manage the timeline for collection, the mini tippers are engaged to collect the waste from smaller areas or Gauten areas. The collected waste is connected to the compactors moving on the routes defined at various points of the city. After collecting the waste from their respective routes, the compactors proceed to the landfill ground at Turbe. The compactors are weighed on the landfill ground weighing machine and the weight details are fed in the computer and a receipt is given to the driver. Then the waste is dumped in the processing unit or landfill location as per the instructions of the landfill ground authority. At the processing plant, the waste is loaded into the waste processing plant with the help of JCB and the waste is segregated for RGF, recyclable and compost processing. The compost plant processes the compost and is bagged and used for various purposes. In addition, 
and MMCs operating mechanized street sweeping vehicles to keep the city clean. The compactors and tippers return back to the station after dumping the garbage and then the vehicles are washed properly and if there is any breakdown or problem in any vehicle, it's fixed by the same day in the workshop by trained mechanics. For the past one year, we have been carrying this operation and it has been very effective in keeping the city clean and helping the natives live in a healthier environment.